Okay, so we woke up late. Um, we were laying in bed and my mom called and she's like, are you guys ready? And I was like, ah, no. So she came and we had to hurry up and get ready. So I just have to get dressed and then we're ready to go out the door. So I'm ready to go out the door. We're gonna head to my mom's and she's gonna get changed cause she just came back from the gym. And then we're gonna head across the river, go see my grandma, get lunch, go to the bank, go to Weir's and get my stuff from Amazon and do a little bit of shopping. So we're going over the bridge to Sioux, Michigan. Our order. And there was an order that I placed on Amazon that I always get it shipped to Weir's. It's like a pack and ship place. And I called to see how many packages I had because I already always order more than one thing. And they said there was no orders. And I said, what? So I gave him the tracking number and he was telling me that the tracking number was from Newberry, North Carolina. Um, so I called Amazon and Amazon said that it was shipped to Salt St. Marie, Michigan because everyone thinks that when they pronounce where we live it's salt, but it's Sault Ste. Marie, Michigan. Um, so I don't know what to do. Um, they said that they were going to contact the seller and go from there, but she said it was shipped there. So I think we're going to go there some point today and try to see what's going on. And this is the bridge Very pretty. that we're going over right now. You can see down there. The SR. Yeah, that's SR over there. And then this is the bridge. The locks. And then the Sioux locks are down there. Can't really see that good because we're driving really fast. And then they're down there. Uh, people go fishing down there. I don't see no fishermen today. But this is the bridge and then it has the Canadian flag and the American flag up here. You can't see them that good because they're not out, but that's the flags. Now we're in Sioux, Michigan. So you need a passport or a Nexus card to get over here. Oh, there's a ship all or the, a boat all the way that way. The average And it's pretty cool that we can go from Canada to Michigan in a minute of five minutes. But sometimes when there's a concert in Canada, that the bridge is so packed up, or if there's a concert over here in Sioux, Michigan, that sometimes we're waiting forever. The longest I've ever waited on the bridge was an hour and a half. That's the longest I've ever waited on the bridge for. And then that's the a border. Redesigned Customs. Funny thing about when they built this uh, place, they decided to build it with grass on the roof. And my dad makes a joke all the time. It's I wonder if someone goes up there and mows it. But I've never seen one person up there mowing it because. I think that's like really dangerous, but 
that I think that's so funny having grass on a roof. Like, do you know what it prevents or helps? I think it just brings birds. If you know what it helps or prevents or why they have grass on the roof, please put in the comments below. So we just went to Weir's and they told us our package wasn't there, that it was at the post office. So we are at the post office trying to figure this out. Um, yeah, I have no idea what's going on with my package. Hello. One yeah. person says it's here, one person says it's there. The tracking number says it's somewhere else. I have no idea. I'm so. being a little worried because I want that cat bed and it's for our cat and I really want it to come with this sticker. So I'm oh, curious to see what's gonna happen. So what we figured about my Amazon order that whoever the seller was, they shipped it to somewhere different but put in the address of where I was and for some reason it said that it shipped to um, the pack and ship place but the tracking number is different so when we went to the UPS store and they said they tracked it and they said that it went to there so I'm gonna have to call Amazon again when I get back home to tell them that this is the new information and we need to cancel my order and give me my money back and we need my cat bed. So we will go from there and see what happens. So we came to Clyde's drive-in and this is the boat that you take to go to Sugar Island. It's a ferry. But we're not going to go. Hi there. How are you guys doing today? We're good. How about you? Good. What can I get for you? We have... So, we're just waiting here on our food. I'm hungry. Oh. And I'm actually really mad. Why are you mad? Because the cat bed didn't come in. It went to a different person. But hopefully that person had the... Has the cat? Yeah. Um, if you're the person who has it, please send it to us. <laughs> you're funny. Um, yeah, we were supposed to get a cat bed and it was supposed to be a shark, Food. but it never came. There's the Roberta Bondar, right there, that white thing over there. So that's Sault Ste. Marie, Ontario, all the way over there. That's pretty not that far away. So we're not hop, far away. Yeah, hop, skip, and a jump away. So we just got lunch and went to my grandma's place and finished eating there. And now we are at the bank. And now after the bank we are going to Walmart, Join Fabrics, and a couple other stores, I'm not too sure. Then we're going back to my grandma's to give her some money. And then, I don't know what we're doing after that. So we're going to go to Joanne Fabrics because I want to see if they have something um, so I don't have to order it online. So this is Joanne Fabrics right there and we're going to go in and so we're going to Walmart right now. Um, Walmart is having some construction going on in one parking lot. So there's only one parking lot going on right now. So it's really jam-packed in the parking lot. Uh, so we have to go in the outdoor living side. So that's the construction over there. And then we're going to go into the outdoor lane. That's construction over there. Avocado. 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 What's, what's that song? I don't know. How's it go? Peel the avocado. Eat the avocado. Guacamole. Guacamole. After 
They make turquoise Gatorade. Kind of the turk um, frost arctic blizz. Kind of want So we are down at Walmart. We are heading to the car. And then where are we going now? Joe Gordon. And then we're going back to the home. Back to the home or how about back to Weirs? And then back to Weirs. Or back to Weirs and then grandma's. Doesn't matter. I don't know, we'll find out. So we're going this way to get out of Walmart. And this is the stupidest way. Right here at this stop sign, this guy was right there and we were turning over here and he went straight and he T-boned us three and a half years ago. And we were in a Toyota Echo and he was in a pickup truck and he wasn't paying attention apparently. I will put a picture of the, what the car looked after right here. There's an airplane coming. Oh my god, it looks so cool! It's so fast. Yeah, that's the end of the airplane. So we just got home and I cleaned up a bit and I got Alexis another earring holder. So she's got one right here. Full? Full of earrings and all these earrings and there's some in this cupboard so I'm gonna fill this up so right now I'm having the biggest panic attack and freak out of my life I'm the cleanest person and I hate mess like mess freaks me out so let's see what I'm working with my gate is off, so right there. My wine rack, man, it's right there. It's supposed to be over here. The stand for the fish tank that my husband wanted to buy is right here. And the big dilemma. I will turn the light on so you can see better. Is this giant 120 gallon fish tank. So that is what I'm dealing with right now. That and the lights for the top is right here. So we're waiting for my husband's friend, my sister's boyfriend to come back because he had to go eat dinner because he didn't eat yet and then they're going to bring it into where the stand is and then my other biggest dilemma of all life is out here so I got all my patio stuff over here and backyard's kind of bare Alex is doing an aerial, an aerial on her trampoline we're trying to get this fence down as much as possible so these trees tomorrow can come down. Happy life! Not happy life. I am not happy. I don't like mess. And I don't like cleaning up mess. But I like cleaning. But not clean up messes that I... I don't make. Oh, and apparently I have to help. And there's the spiders everywhere. So I have to put the camera down. So we finally got the fish tank in the living or in the dining room for now. This is not where it's staying. So that's the fish tank. It's 120 gallons. And then this is the stand for it. We're gonna get um, 
curtain rods and put them all around and then get little curtains to cover it up so you don't see all the stuff. And then I will show you where it's actually going to go. So, we're bringing our washer and dryer upstairs. So, this washer and dryer are going upstairs. The, that cabinet's going to go in the garage. And then this cabinet's going to go upstairs. And then the freezer's going to go in the garage. and. The cat tower is going to go upstairs and we're going to rearrange this. And that's where the fish tank's going to go. But it won't be in there for another probably a month because we have to bring the washer and dryers up and then my husband has to um, level the floor. So he's going to put slate on the floor underneath the fish tank. And that's it. Please like, subscribing. Come in for more videos like this. Bye! So I guess I'm going to have to buy another earring holder because she still has 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14 and then the ones in her ear. And I filled the whole thing up. So I'm going to have to buy her another one.